Now, I want to remind the Congress party and Mr. Nagaraj Adav, on a similar instance which happened just few months ago, Mr. Kempana had written a letter to Prime Minister and from the Union government they sent officials. Please note on Mr. Nagaraj Adav, 28-6-2002, Mr. Kempana himself told I will be providing the documents and thereafter he did not even give an iota of evidence. This is only a Congress toolkit. They are making unsubstantiated allegations through no, 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 it's not unsubstantiated. Madhu, Madhu, it's not unsubstantiated. There's an audio tape right now that's doing the rounds, which they released in this press conference, in which they're saying that Timurid is speaking. Whether the Congress is saying it's 5%, 40%, corruption is corruption. The percentage doesn't matter. May I answer? Yeah, give me some time. Give me, give me some time. My only point is, no one has stopped the Congress party who has, you know, un the tallest leaders who are advocates, who stopped it from going and complaining before local stuff? We are telling, please go and complain. Why are you so shying away from the fact? I am telling you, this is only a Congress toolkit to bring down our government's image, to put on our government's image before the public. Now, I want to ask you one question. They are making Mr. so much of money. You are defending a wrong case. You are being an advocate. You know it. One at a time, please. One at a time. Mr. Yadav, I will give you a chance to respond. Let Madhu finish his point. The Congress party wants to think that they are supreme. They are the Supreme Court of India. They know everything and whatever they say is correct. And sorry, Mr. Nagaraj Yadav, you have taken it wrong. And let okay. me remind Congress party, on a similar instance, how many cases have they gone before the Supreme Court and they got a, you know, slapping from the Supreme Court? May I remind them as to what happened in the Supreme Court on so many cases? Because they okay. are just politically motivated and they are talking all these things. Let me tell. Give me 30 seconds. These people, you know, politically agitated, what happened to them in Supreme Court in all those cases? Ayodhya, they got slapped. Rohingya, they got slapped. People Salah, they got slapped. Indian, they got slapped. Rafael, they got slapped. Okay, okay, Ayodhya, you made your, you made your point. Madhu, Madhu, you made your point. You made your point. Mr. Yadav, considering that the Congress has raised this now. One second, one second. Just listen to my question, Mr. Yadav. Madhu, hold on. You made your point. You made your point, Mr. Nagaraj Yadav. Considering that the Congress has raised this issue and your highest leaders, your tallest leaders are now tweeting out saying 40% commission Sarkara, will the Congress now follow this up, take up the cause of the contractors and take this issue to court? 100% we will take up the matter more than the court. We have taken up the matter in the, in the assembly too. They do not prepare to, prepare to debate in the assembly sessions. Why are they hiding from? Why are they getting away from? Why are they running away from that? Why are they cutting short the 10 days debate into 9 days? Why are they stopping these things? It's a, it's a public platform, it's a session today. We have taken up the thing, we have given notices in the council as well as in the assembly. They are not replied, ready to reply. My question is that the contractor association is a registered organization in the country and it has been complaining of a, a corruption since past mm. two years. Why are they not setting up a commission and looking into this matter Valid and point. having a sitting judge inquiring into this matter? I am telling that whichever government is involved in this, whichever MLA is involved, whichever political party is involved, please bring it out to the people's notice. That is our okay. demand. Today, BJP okay. MLA taking 90 lakh rupees and threatening them for about 20,000 rupees. Is it fair enough? 